துறையந்தாய் போற்றி பாகம் பெண்ணுருவானாய் போற்றி அருள்மிகு ஏலவார் குழலியுடன் அவர் ஏகாம்பரநாதர் திருவடிகள் போற்றி போற்றி Hey friends, you have just heard the praise of Lord Ekambaranatha in Tamil. We are in the premises of Lord Ekambaranatheshwara Temple in Kanchipuram. It is significant to the Hindu sect of Shaivism as one of the temples associated with the five elements, the Panchabhuta Stalas. Shiva is worshipped here as Prithvi Lingam that represents element earth. The presiding deity is revered in the 7th century Tamil Shaiva canonical work, the Thevaram, written by Tamil saint poets known as the Nayanars and classified as Padal Petra Stalam. Lord Ekambaranatha is praised by the four Shaivites saints Tirugnana Sambandar, Tirunnavukkarasar, Sundarar and Manikka Vasagar. This vast temple is one of the most ancient in India, having been in existence since at least 600 CE. The temple finds mention in the classical Tamil Sangam literature dated 300 BC like Mani Megalai and Perupanara Puppattai. This is the first Lord Shiva temple in Thondai Nadu region praised in Thevaram and Tiruvasagam hymns. The temple complex covers 25 acres and is one of the largest in India. It houses four gateway towers known as Gopurams. The tallest is the Southern Tower built by Krishnadevaraya. It has 11 stories with a height of 192 feet, making it one of the tallest temple towers in India. The temple complex houses many halls. The most notable is a thousand-pillared hall built during the Vijayanagara period. The present masonry structure was built during the Chola dynasty in the 9th century, while later expansions are attributed to Vijayanagara rulers. Outside the Ekambaranath temple, there is a mango tree that is believed to be around 3,500 years old. There are four separate branches found on the tree that represent the four Vedas. Tradition has it that the fruit from each branch tastes different even though they are all on the same tree. There is no separate shrine for Parvati within the temple complex as is the norm with the other Shiva temples in the Kanchipuram. A local belief is that Kamakshi Amma is a consort of Lord Ekambaranatha. Rays of sun fall on the presiding deity on the Rasa Saptami day in January-February. Kampai Tirtha, a temple tank in the premises, is believed to have an underground holy river.